Yo, what's good guys, Coach of Tech here. So today we got another Bluetooth speaker to review. Let's go. I'm actually excited for this one a lot. So check it, this one is from Eco Gear. Now, remember you cast remember that Deemer box. So basically this is something similar to the Deemer box. So this is the Eco Gear. This is the Eco Journey. It's from the company Eco, Eco Gear. It's the speaker, it's called Eco Journey. But anyway, rugged waterproof speaker. Uh, we have 60 watt, 65 watts, 50 hours of playtime, uh, playback. Uh, but you got to understand with this, uh, with the playtime, it all depends on the volume you listen to. So depending on the volume, you'll get it. This is, I want to say, what are they? I'm gonna show you guys basically what they're advertising. But you get a 20, uh, 20,000 um, milliamp power bank, which is nice. So big battery, IP67, Bluetooth 5. So basically, all the bells and whistles with this, um, with this Bluetooth speaker. Like I said, it. I'll go into it, we got 65. Anyways, you guys see it here, I'm not gonna go into detail. Uh, we got literature here, all the specs and whatever I missed, I'll have in the description below. Also, the speaker is $170, so it's half of the Deemer box. Um, everything is here, I'm gonna put that in the description, make it simple, but now the reason why, the reason why I keep on saying to the Deemer bo box, because if you guys did see my review, my video to that, uh, to that speaker, I was disappointed. For the price, they were wanted 350 for that thing, and that thing didn't even perform. And watch the video, you'll understand why. But anyways, this is almost half the price. All right, so this is basically 170 dollars less. You feel me? So this is this is what, what this is 170, and the Deemer box is basically what would they have? The 350. That's insane. You know what I'm saying? So it's absolutely insane. But anyways, let's uh, unbox it. So you got your waterproof, you got your mud proof, you got your sand proof, your shock proof, and stone proof. So what I'm trying to say is for all you country cats out there who do your craw fishing, uh, who do your regular fishing, and what else you country cats do, who you do your dirt biking, man, who all you cats who do that, you know, for that country stuff, this speaker is for you, man. For us city boys, man. <laughs> but anyways, coach your calm down. Quit playing now. But anyways, check out the packaging. Oh, it comes out like this. Like that. Alright, so the packaging is absolutely fuego. Alright, important to read that. Now we got the speaker. All right, so the speaker's out the box now. I think it only comes in black. I'm not sure on Amazon, I only saw it in basically in black. So it does look pretty fuego here in the black color. Uh, okay, we have two woofers over here. We have a power button. Speaker mode. Okay, so it's on. We have Bluetooth, we have mic. Ready to connect. And I think this is some- Cocast uh, transmitting. Cocast, I gotta see what the heck this Ecocast is. Cocast receiving. And this is the volume buttons, play and pause. We have uh, track left, track right, skip track, all that. Now, this is also like a Pelican case, so if you snap it, oh damn, I like how that sounds. You could, how do you, oh, so, I'm, I'm confused, how do you release? Oh, okay, so you just take the levers out, and it opens all the way. Okay, so that's actually pretty cool, because in the Deemer box, you guys only saw it, and it's heavy here. This is basically where all the battery and the electronics are on this side. And the Deemer box, you guys remember, again, like I said, video is going to be compared. Definitely watch the Deemer box too. You guys get a better understanding. In the Deemer box, basically, it only went 90 degrees. So what that meant is it always tilted. And I did complain. It was like almost like this and always and always tilted. And I did complain that in my video because if I'm putting stuff in, it kind of, I got to first put the stuff in to like let it go and then for me to leave. But here, it opens all the way out. This is absolutely fuego. I don't understand. Like, hello, Deemer box. I don't know what your cats was doing with there, but... Very nice. We have the accessories here. We're going to check them actually right now. I am curious what we get. Now, I hope uh, I hope they didn't give us a proprietary K. Oh, okay. So, all right. All right. So the booklet is here. Okay. So we do have a strap. Nice. It's included. We do have. Okay. So we do have a power bank over here. How many, how many watts? I want to say it's a power. Doesn't say. It doesn't say. But anyways, this is USB. Okay, so it's USB-C. So that's actually a good thing. It is USB-C, uh, USB-A to USB-C. We could actually charge this as well. So it's not proprietary. I think, what was it? Uh, the Turtle Box did have a proprietary cable, which I actually did unlike. But this, we actually don't, we don't have a proprietary. And this, the strap is included. Now the booklet, let's see what we get with it. Basically just everything about the speaker, how to charge. You know all that all that good stuff but anyways here we have a little compartment over here so essentially we could put a bunch of things in here so 
you know, this is type, like I said, it's a Pelican design. So if like a Pelican case design. So if you're on the move, if you got some stuff you're gonna put in, I'm gonna show you guys exactly what actually fits in here. But I like this very compartmentalized. You know, you have it, you close it. Oh, wait, what? Holy, hold up. Yo, this is sick. It doesn't smash, it doesn't slam. Oh, well that slammed a bit, but if I like, Oh, this is so nice. It doesn't slam. Yo. Nice. I'm gonna try it one more time. Fuego, man. All right, look, I'm a hype. All right, I'm hyped. $170 compared to what Deemer Box actually gave us for three fifty. dollars Okay, if it's like this, but hold up. Let me try to do it. So <laughs> this is nice. Yeah, I'm feeling this pelling in case. Anyways. We got a uh, USB-A, we have auxiliary, we have the charging port over here, USB-C, and this is on and off, I wanna say 5 volt to 2.1 amps. I wanna say, I, I believe this is for uh, for using it as a power bank, if I'm not mistaken. And we have IPS67, like I said, so you could throw this in the water. Not fully submergible, but you could definitely get it in, you know, you could get it wet and this is nice. Man. So, but if we close it, we so we close it, we lock it. This is good. Okay, and I and I think this right here property belongs to. I believe you could take this out and put your name in here. I want to say. And then we have the eco X gear over here. But anyways, let me put some stuff in here. Let me see exactly what's what fits. So I quickly just grabbed some stuff. Also, I want to mention you could put little locks over here to actually lock the case. So if I, you know, if you're traveling and whatnot, if you throw it in the airport. Uh, and, and to luggage and whatnot, you could uh, basically lock them as well. And I think with these cases, if you have a firearm and whatnot, you could also lock them as well and basically travel if I'm not mistaken. But the handlebar, the handle grip is also very nice. But let's say, all right, this is like, you know, I have my camera over here, my Canon 80D. I have another Sony camera over here. I got my phones. <laughs> Damn, that's a lot of space. I got these things I could throw in here. Let's see if it's gonna close because this. All right, yeah, so this is hitting the camera. So this side, since this is obtruding, so what you're gonna wanna do essentially is put the stuff here, put these stuff, right? Let's see. Put it like that, put it like that. And I wanna save this. It's gonna close now, I'm just curious. So like big things like this won't really fit unless if you maneuver them right. But damn, this camera's pissing me. So here, this should close, right? There you go. I think this is closed. Man, now this is closed. But anyways, like if you have things like this that's really protruding and you gotta really organize them, it's essentially close them because they don't, now it's not like really closing, but these Pelican things also very, really annoy me because the, the hardware side of this is always gonna be basically uh, expanded out. So when you actually do close it, it's not gonna be, you know, it's gonna be basically blocking like a quarter of the room. So just keep that in mind. So it has to be small things, maybe more like flush things like phones or something that are not just as wide or as big as, you know, other things basically. But it has enough storage here. You could put it underneath and you could organize it. You know, you guys could play with it and essentially enjoy it however you like. But I am honestly feeling this. I just love how they designed it. I'm feeling the price, man. It's not expensive whatsoever. You don't have to spend $350. And you could also put it a strap as I showed you guys and basically care with it. But now I wanna test the sound. I am curious, like I said, how it sounds. And hopefully it's gonna sound better than the uh, Deemer box because I was really, really disappointed with the Deemer box, but it's not that bad. And like I said, I'm gonna have all the specs and anything that I missed in the comments below, but in the description below. But listen, man, for $170, I am feeling it. Now, let's see how it sounds. Let's go. Oh, no. 
cintura y nada más. Muévete pa' adelante y después pa' atrás. Acércate bonita, que la vi muy bien. Que tu guava la otra vez. Que tu guava la otra vez. So look, I mean, I'm going to show you guys, obviously other speakers right now, we're going to demo it versus other speakers, but if you're going to get the speaker, it's not the best sounding speaker. I mean, if you want a speaker that's best sounding, I'm going to put other speakers here. You guys can compare for yourself. But for me personally, this isn't the best sounding speaker, but if you want that rugged, that country lifestyle, you know, craw fishing, um, you know, dirt biking, all that, <laughs> all that stuff, I guess... You know, this is a good speaker for that, especially if you're considering whether, you know, to go to Deemer box or the Ergo gear, 100% Ergo gear, because very similar boxes, but this one is significantly uh, less expensive, cheaper than the Deemer box, in my opinion. But like I said, for music wise, I would probably stay away from this, but for like the rugged, that lifestyle wise, I would say it's not that bad price, definitely copper, but now let's test other speakers. Let's go.
sé qué va a pasar Solo tú bailas conmigo Pero no como amigos Así todos quieren contigo Y en la disco eso se siente Ya, ya Oh, <laughs> 